ho, ho, Merry Cat Christmas, everybody. Has your cat found the Christmas spirit yet? If not, how about making him or her a tiger cat uh, home? And this, by the way, is one of my most popular makes ever. And now I want to show you how to turn it into a tiger cat Christmas house. How about that? The first thing I want to do is to show you how to change the color from a sort of tiger orange into a more Christmassy red. I got here red paint and a uh, medium big brush. Everywhere where there is orange, I now paint red down to about here where the kind of the warm yellow starts and then I stop. Next color is pink down here where uh, the warm yellow is. Then we go for some polka dotted uh, Christmas curtains, different size dots. Ooh, that'll be nice. Finally, some Christmas freckles. Then I will let this dry for a little while while I show you the next thing. With some cardboard, I've cut the piece of a cardboard box, added a bit of cardboard here, and I have a perfect Christmas party plate for our cat. I've taken a milk carton like this and then cut the bottom piece off like this three times. And those containers, when I put them in here, they fit perfectly. Look at this. One, two, and three in a perfect fit. Now your cat can have three different party snacks all at the same time. All we need now is a Christmas tree. Yeah, this doesn't look much like a Christmas tree, does it? But imagine if we stick it in here and we then cut it into a tree, that'll be a perfect tree. So let me show you how to cut it. We start with drawing some Christmas tree shapes and then we cut that out. And then we paint it Christmas tree green. There, and while this is drying, I'll paint the party plate with a nice Christmas red just like the cat house. Then, when it's dry, why don't we give it some uh, white polka dots? Yeah, that'll be nice and cheerful. Now, while this is drying, uh, we can decorate the tree. Have about white and red Christmas balls. And finally, I've cut a star out of cardboard, put some glue on it, and on it goes. Beautiful Christmas tree. Next thing we need to do is to cut the ears and the tail and fold them up. And then I need to glue on some cardboard to make the ears stand up straight. Gorgeous cat with the ears straight up. Now is the time to decorate the inside and making it nice and cozy in there. I have a red towel, Christmas red towel putting it gently inside and a red little cushy cushion that used to be a Christmas stocking but now it's a cushion. Maybe I should fill it with something. Yeah, <laughs> snow, yes. I'll fill it with a bit of snow like that. In it goes. My cat will love to play with this one. And then some more snow. I got lots of snow. It's actually cotton wool, but you know, we'll pretend it's snow. <laughs> it's gonna be nice and messy, yeah. And then Santa hat, of course. On it goes, yes. Come to think of it, I think I wanna cut and open up these whiskers as well. Then I'll put in the lights and then the food. We put in the three little containers, apple, pear, and chocolate muffin. Does your cat love this? My cat, Snowball, he loves it. Well, talk about Snowball. Uh, I, I got some snow here. Yes, a bit of snow for Snowball. Snowball loves to watch television, so I'm gonna surprise him with a flat screen, nice big flat screen for him. Let's see what's on the telly tonight. Mm. Oh yeah. Tiger Cat House, his favorite.